today has been a day. <laughs> I'll just leave it at that. It's definitely been a day, y'all. Alrighty then. Welcome to day 20 something on the Appalachian Trail through hike. Today I've packed up. Me and Heavy are here, the last ones at the shelter. Even though I said I would get up and leave early. Um, you know, you can't always get what you want, especially when it's cold. You can see your breath and your sleeping bag is nice and warm. Today, for breakfast, I had a package of nuts with chocolate chips. I'm going to be eating these blueberries, honey peanut butter packets, and white chocolate macadamia nut. You guys already know the adjective. We're getting gourmet out here. Just wanted to show you all what it's like sometimes. Sometimes you look in front of you, you look behind you, you look above you, and you realize, wow, this is what it's actually like to hike the AT. <laughs> I just put one foot in front of the other millions of times. It's very mundane. I'm approaching Allen Gap. This section of trail has been exceptionally pleasing, I will say. It's been a lot of downhill with a little mixture of climbs. I haven't even broke a sweat yet. It's just enough strenuous activity to keep me warm. My hands are no longer numb, so that is quite enjoyable. It's um, starting to be a sunny day. And the way the light is casting through this laurel forest has me feeling a certain way. And so I thought I would share the view. Log Cabin Drive is just around the bend where I will hang a right on the Southern Cookie Ladies Drive and hopefully snag some decadence. We'll see what's going on there. I know she's got water and trash collection, so I'm gonna thank the Southern Cookie Lady in advance. You guys know me with my excessive gratitude. <laughs> They are the hiking family of today. <laughs> Smoke walker, nomad, gunslinger. <laughs> Just kidding, I made a mistake, it's smoke dancer. Very important distinction and gunslinger. Quick draw. Oh my gosh, okay, it's too early for this guys. Quick draw, I'm sorry. <laughs> Assuming I'm like a half mile away. Oh yeah, I can see the road. So cookies are coming in hot. Hopefully they're coming hot. Let's see, I'm gonna put the manifestation out there that she's pulling them out of the oven right now. The anticipation is building. What? My legs just picked up speed. I'm not even controlling this. I'm suddenly going faster. Like a truck with no brakes. What is happening? My body, I don't have control. I'm the cookie monster. Ah, there it is. The famed cabin in the woods. And the cookie lady, or the cookie husband of the cookie lady. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, I'm gonna turn this off just to respect their domicile. <clears throat> and I'll see if it's okay if I can take a video when I'm up there. All right, I made it. Southern cookie lady is out here. 
providing the trail magic and their um, oatmeal cookie with almond and apricots. And I will say, they're delicious. I bought three and I had my first free one, so yes, you got water, you got cleanliness, and you got good, good vibes in a beautiful place. So that's all I have to say. Just a thanks to Southern Cookie Lady. Check it out. Okay, well, I'm fueled by cookies now. Got some climbing to do. The weather is quite nice. It's cold with a side of sunshine. Okay, friends, I'm excited for this. I'm pulling up on a beautiful on-trail lunch cafe. They got fresh water. They've got a bathroom. They got outdoor seating, campfire. It's right on trail. Let's see what uh, what this is like here. There it is. The On Trail Cafe. <laughs> gotcha, it's just a shelter, y'all. You serve yourself at this cafe. But it is right on trail. Is that tricky? Did you think there's actually something here? Look at that. You got free clothing. How wonderful. How considerate of people. They leave their stuff behind for you. So nice of them. <laughs> I'm gonna have some coffee here and kick back for a moment. Look at the quality. This is a sitable table in the sun. All right. Apparently this is the way to Blackstack Cliffs. It's an unmarked trail. It's marked on the map, just there's no sign. I chose not to go to White Rock Cliffs because there's, it's a peregrine falcon nesting area. And it's not off limits, but I just think that with birds like that, they deserve to have some space. Oh my. I'm not quite there yet. Oh, I gotta keep going. This is kind of kind of a weird one here. It's also quite muddy down there. I prefer to not sink into that. Oh. Oh. I don't think I have a choice. Oh, no. My. Okay. Okay. Well then, that was... My socks are officially wet. <laughs> but... Oh yeah. That is a fine view.
This section of trail is just extraordinary. If you ask me, the way that it's built, the way these rock steps are laid, very cool. Yeah, give me that sunshine. Ooh, this is nice. Uh, I was just gonna tune in and say that my plan is to have a little bit of lunch at um, Jerry's cabin, which is coming up here shortly. But it also now, it's a great time to record because, wow. Yowza. I think we got Tennessee on the left and North Carolina on the right, or vice versa. Wow. Now look at this trail. I really am thankful for the fellow or fellows that, oh, our ladies, whoever it was, did this work. Man. Just views all around. Very nice. Today has been a day. <laughs> I'll just leave it at that. It's definitely been a day, y'all. Yeah, Jerry Cabin, Jerry's Cabin Shelter is my destination. Oh, look, there's a plaque. Howard's Rock. Oh. That's right. Check it out, folks. I was just expressing gratitude to the builder. Here we go, Howard's Rock, in honor of Howard McDonald, Master Trail Builder, 2015. Thanks, Hope. Oh, I'm on Zoom. Uh, now I'm on, okay, sorry. There we go. That's what I wanted. Oh, man. Oh, woman, don't want to sound too machismo or whatever that term is. Pretty, pretty. Another great day to be at such a vista. I mean, it's just one spot after another. Just perfect weather and gorgeous views couldn't have asked for a better through hike this year so far it has just been splendid Cold rain, make it really 300 miles Late last night. Cold rain, uh -huh. I called it I literally put the camera away 30 seconds later not even 30 seconds there she is. And it's three dogs. My man. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Hi there. Sabbath. I remember Sabbath. What up, dude? This is what I'm eating. Wakame miso. I'm excited for this. Shine on this frail head of mine. Sunshine. Sunshine. You've been making shadows. Wherever I go, shadow, don't you bother me anymore, don't you darken up my door, shadow, don't you follow me anymore, just lie and stay yeah, there seen. on the floor, this is Sabbath, lie and stay there on the floor. Through hiker dog, I've ever known. All right, that's all you get. Okay. 
after some ramen and a cup of coffee, I have moved on. I left that shelter behind. Hiking through this field right now. It's, it's gorgeous up here. Flint Mountain Shelter, five miles on the dot. I couldn't help but take a video of this. How does this even happen? It's this giant boulder split right down the middle. Looks like an excellent climbing spot. Like, I would love to come out here with some chalk and a couple of crash pads. Hit that up. Massive. Split right down the middle. Like, <laughs> what caused that? I can see the shelter. See who's here. Hello, my friends. It's the it's the family. I was just talking about you guys earlier. I was like, they gave me this coffee. Okay, this is what we're having tonight, folks. Three sisters, Southwestern quinoa and beans, chana masala. Got a total of 1,080 calories, 39 grams of protein. Yep, that's me. That's my voice. Get a little switcheroo there on you. And that's where the mothership is for tonight. Still nice in the area. Right the there. <laughs> and then I got Mosey next door. And then my friend, uh, Quick Draw, has just arrived. And we got Baconator and Sugar Dump, Mark and Skittles. <laughs> They have, they were the, they were the ones that gave me the blueberries and the coffee from my day today, so love these guys. Okay, I'm gonna eat dinner and call it an